All right, so what does this look like from a student's point of view? So go ahead and go to classroom.google.com and log into your class. Um, or log into your classroom and then select the class where you want to be. Okay, students, so we have stream, classwork, and people. So underneath people, you would see your teacher and you might be able to message the teacher if you have that set up in, on your site. But most of your time will be spent in classwork. This will show you everything that your teacher has assigned for you. Notice over on the left, and it's even showing you that your topics are over here on the side. So if you wanna see the things from unit one, click on unit one, and you will see everything that your teacher has posted for unit one. If you're working on unit two, click on unit two, and again, you'll see what's been posted for unit two. So um, let's look at unit one. And you'll notice the teacher has posted a question. What are two ways to catch attention in your essay? And you can type your answer right here. With a quote or an analogy. And then you click turn in. If you want to ask the question, a uh, question of the teacher, you can post something here if you don't understand it. And you won't be able to make changes. If you're positive, click Turn In. Some of the other items might be something such as this, an essay. So I'm going to click on this assignment. And you'll notice that this is showing you where to turn in when you're finished. So here's some information. Write a strong persuasive essay introduction be sure to watch the video tutorials before you begin so I'd click on the video tutorials and then when I'm finished and I've typed my essay or I finished watching the tutorial and I'm ready to type my essay I'm going to click add or create and I'm going to create a doc and type my essay if I needed to create a slideshow, I'd click slideshow, sheets, or drawing. Sometimes the teacher will give you something to start with. And I can click here and find out that yes, the teacher did give me something to start with. And I would finish this up, close this window when I'm done, and when I'm ready to turn it in, I click turn in. If I have a question about this assignment, I can add a private comment, and this comment will go to my teacher so that she can reply to me. If I want something to go to the whole class, I can add a comment here, and I could maybe post some information that might help my classmates do this particular assignment. Again, when I'm done, I click Turn In. It says, are you sure that you want to turn it in? And I click Turn In. Now my teacher has control over my document and will return it to me when she's done grading it. When I want to get back to my work, I just click up here where it says my double fake class. It will get me back to my stream, my classwork, and my people. Again, click classwork. Got it. And if my teacher has graded this, I will be able to click and see my grade. And that should get you started with Google Classroom.